Uh, friends, we have an interesting question with us. Digital sum of a number is obtained by adding all the digits of a number until a single digit is obtained. Find the digital sum of 19 raised to 100. Now, what do you think? Can we expand this? No, no way we cannot expand this. So, how do we find the digital sum? See, there is a funda over here. See, for any number, suppose I have number 23. What is the digital sum? That's 2 plus 3, 5, right? Suppose I have number 349. What is the digital sum? 3 plus 4 plus 9. So it's 9 plus 4, 13. 13 and 3, 16. And 1 plus 6, 7, right? So digital sum of this is 7. Digital sum of this is 5. I take one more example over here. It's maybe 1, 2, 3, 7, right? So this 7 and 3, 10. 11, 12 and 13. So digital sum is 4, right? Now here 5, 7 and 4. Now just listen to me carefully. What is the alternative method of getting the digital sum? That is, if you divide this particular number by 9, so whatever the remainder you will be getting, that will be nothing but the digital sum. I just write it over here. Right? Digital sum is what? Divide that number by 9 and get the remainder. Right? So 23, if you divide by 9, so 9 twos are 18, 5 is the remainder, that is the digital sum. 349, if you divide it by 9, uh, 9 threes are 27. 7 and 9, 9 eights are 72, so 7 is the remainder, so that is the digital sum. Similarly over here, 9 ones are 9, 3, 9 uh, threes are 27, 6, 9 uh, sevens are 63, so 4 is the remainder, so the digital sum is 4, right? So precisely what we are doing, we are just dividing the number by 9 and getting the remainder. So whatever is the remainder, that will be the digital sum of that particular number, right? So now what we have to do, we have to divide 19 raised to 200. Since we cannot expand this, as uh, we have these numbers in like already expanded form, but we cannot expand 19 raised to 200, right? So what we'll do, uh, we'll divide 19 raised to 200 by 9 and we'll get the remainder. And whatever is that remainder, that will be the digital sum of 19 raised to 200. Now, how would we divide? Obviously, uh, not uh, logical to expand it and divide by 9. So, see 19, closer to 19, that is a number that's 18, that's multiple of 19, right? So, um, I'm sorry, 9. So, 19 can be written as 18 plus 1 raised to 200, right? Now, if you divide this expression by 19, I'm um, sorry, by 9, what you'll be getting? See, if 18 is divided by 9, the remainder will be 0, right? because 18 is multiple of 9. So if you divide this expression by 9, you will be getting the remainder as 1 raised to 100 or precisely it is 1, right? Okay, so till here, uh, the, our answer is 1, because the digital sum of 19 raised to 200 is 1. And if you are not clear that how do we find this remainder, it's very easy friends. Uh, you just, uh, maybe uh, we, you are having number 10 into 10 into 10, whatever, right? Okay, so if you you have to find out the remainder if suppose 10 cube is divided, uh, I just take it away, 10 cube is divided by 100, uh, um, I'm sorry, by 9, so what will be the remainder? So you divide and find out the remainder in each case. Here the remainder is 1, here the remainder is 1, here the remainder is 1, right? And multiply all of them. So the final remainder when 1000 is divided by 9 will be? one only okay so if you divide individual number and get the remainder then multiply all the remainders till you get the final answer less than the divisor then that will be your remainder right so similarly 19 raised to 200 is 19 into 19 into 19 200 times just divide by 9 and get the remainder in each case so it's 1 into 1 into 1 for 200 times am i right okay so 1 into 1, 200 times, that will be 1 only, right? So this is how we can calculate the remainder. So in this sum, we were to calculate the digital sum. So digital sum will be if 19 raised to 100 is divided by 9, we, get, we are getting the remainder as 1. So that only will be the digital sum of 19 raised to 100. Maybe it's 100 or 200. Okay, I have calculated 200, but that, that is a quite similar if it is 19 raised to 100 or 200. Yeah, so digital sum is 1 only. Okay, I hope you are clear.